let us start. So with this wooden ring, I just need to attach two strings using the lark's head knot. For more information on the lark's head knot, you may check out my video on the basic macrame knots. I will provide the link in the description box below. There, so in order to maximize the length of the rope, to avoid wasting too much rope, I, I try to shorten the center because um, there won't be much need for it to be tied to anywhere. It will be idle. So I just need to make the outer strings longer than those in the center. And then... I will put it in this small clipboard just to keep it in place and I will make those full square knots. In between each square knot, I will be leaving a space that would create the loop on the sides. So just like this one, I left that small space around one centimeter and then I will push it upwards so that it would create that loop on the sides but on the succeeding square knots I would make the spaces a little bit bigger than the previous one so the loop would be also bigger and bigger as it goes down there you go you see that bigger loop than the first one so that's how it is and then let's do another one with a bigger space there and then push it upwards to create that bigger loop and then on our last one this will be the biggest space to create the biggest loop on the side so this would be the end of the Christmas decor and there you go done with the first Christmas tree so I will just have to repeat the process for 12 um, pieces of decors and we'll see how it goes done with 12 pieces of Christmas decors that will be attached to the string lights.
let's see how it will look when the lights are on. There you go. Okay, looking great for me. This is good. Next step is to wrap it around the Christmas tree. Hello, Sushi! 